All right. A little over a week ago, Bethesda graced Starfield with a small patch. We now have a field of view slider to adjust first and third person. Uh, they also gave us some stability and performance improvements and a fix to the echoes of the past quest. This got me to thinking about the next big patch we're getting for Starfield. Now, I expect the next big patch, I don't know why I keep saying it like that, but I expect the next big patch to be heavy on quality of life updates and lighter on bug fixes. Starfield is not the buggy mess that we're used to from Bethesda. It's less buggy with less bugs. So today I want to go over some ideas I have for quality of life improvements. Now like, comment, subscribe, super thanks if you want. Let's get into it. This first improvement is a pretty easy one. A button that separates all the ship pieces. Kind of like this picture and not whatever it is I'm trying to do in this video. I mean, honestly, why do we have a select all button if we can't just separate all the pieces of the ship? Is it just for, I don't know, paint so we can paint our ship one color? By separating all the pieces though, it would make it easier to see the individual ship pieces. And I want it. But while we're on the topic of shipbuilding, give us an option to build our own ship from scratch. A blank slate, if you will. When you talk to the tech, just have the option. Build ship. How about that? I don't know why we just can't build a ship. I mean, we can delete pieces and then add them. Why not just give us the blank slate so we can just build it? Moving on. This is a Bethesda game. Why can't we break down weapons and spacesuits slash armor into useless scrap and components? I hate going to New Atlantis or Neon or whatever other place I go to over encumbered with 350 pounds of weapons and armor just to sell three or four of them at a time, then slowly walking to a park bench just to sit there and wait for two days. Like I'm creepy old man person. That guy's been sitting here for two days. Well, I'm just waiting for them to replenish their credits because look at all the weapons I have. And see, that would just bring up more red flags. Why is this guy with a hundred weapons sitting on a park bench for two days? Just give us a scrap option like in Fallout. Because honestly, credits are not hard to come by in Starfield. But a lot of components are. Now, this leads into my next improvement. Crafting ammo. You're telling me I can build an entire starship, upgrade my weapons, my armor, but the skill on how to craft ammo just eludes me. We can do it in Fallout. We can do it in Elder Scrolls. Granted, it's just arrows and bolts, but it's ammo nonetheless. Now I know this one would require the addition of gunpowder or maybe just give us the components and we'll craft our own gunpowder like Fallout 76. Next up, opening doors and containers in scan mode. That's it. I don't even have a joke for this one. Just let us open doors and containers in scan mode. All right, here are a couple rapid fire ones. NPC AI improvements, land vehicles, better inventory management tabs, and searchable star maps for the love of everything that is good and holy. Just give us a search bar so we can type in where we want to go and I don't have to just look around for 10 minutes over every star system trying to find that one planet that had the really cool stuff that I can't remember because I didn't write it down. But this is not an all-inclusive list, obviously. Go ahead, put in the comments your ideas, or expound upon the ideas that I have given, or something to that effect. I don't know. I gotta go search for a planet with some really cool stuff on it. Alright, bye. I thank you for watching. If you like this video, throw a like. Any questions, concerns, complaints, praise, or just general agitation, put it in the comments section below. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. I post every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Also, if you really, really like this video, hit the super thanks button. Help support the channel. All is appreciated. None is required. Remember, be safe out there. And as always, a good day.